The following video is 100% opinionated. If you disagree and or have your own, please feel free to leave it in the comment section below. Have a great day. Oh my god, I cannot believe the reality that we live in right now. For some reason, people don't understand things that they don't like. Jimmy Kimmel, a comedian, made a video and it, it's, people have been watching it. Let's see here, it only got, uh, he got 3,073 likes. Pretty decent. Yeah, how many views it got? 300,000? Yeah, that's good. He's got 33,238 dislikes. Do you know why? Because he was a dumbass during the video. He goes on and he starts making fun of and pretty much destroying that new YouTube gaming, the new YouTube gaming service that they're making on uh, YouTube where it's all about gamers. And he's saying how... You know, he doesn't get why people would want to watch other people play a video game. I understand that, but you got to realize that there's a lot of people that do it. Look, PewDiePie, he's huge, he's massive. He makes over $4 million a year. And he makes a really good career. People like to watch it, people like to watch him play, they think it's entertaining. People think this. Now, Jimmy here, he decides to pretty much just piss off everybody by saying that it was stupid. And he said that this might as well be called the Parents That Failed Their Children Network or something along those lines. And I'm like, oh my god, how dumb can you fucking be? <laughs> to say, to blame parents on this is stupid. Alright? I know that, for, for example, me... I watch a lot of YouTube gamers. I think it's fun. I like to watch them play. I like to watch KY or Speedy and Vanoss because I feel like I'm in that group with them. I feel like I'm there playing with them, just laughing it up, having some fun. I go to the Let's Play and Achievement Hunter, Rooster Teeth. Those are pretty funny. They're comedies. Yeah, good. I go to the Let's Players like Kabonermany456 or Ghost Robo and I feel like I'm playing through a game with them, you know? I might not have enough money to go out and buy a new $60 game every time it comes out, so I go and I watch a YouTuber play it. I watch the reviews. I watch live streams on Twitch, because why not? It's just fun. It's like a big, big party, pretty much. A bunch of people laughing in the comments, talking to each other, watching somebody play a game. It's like an event. And that brings me up to another point. Look at football. Football is a big sport. People all over the place watch NFL football. Could they not as easily just go outside and play football? Yes. Why do they watch football? It's the event. It's fun to watch. You like to watch two people compete against each other trying to win a game. It's the same concept whenever somebody uploads a video on YouTube, except for instead of it being a bunch of football players that are overpaid making millions of dollars to hit each other in sweat, it's some dude named Jimmy sitting in his house with a blue snowball microphone, a pair of headphones, a cheap dazzle, and his Xbox One. That there's the difference. It can be just as entertaining either way. People just don't understand. If you don't play video games, you won't understand this. I know my parents, they don't support my channel. People never, they, they told me I couldn't do it. I couldn't make it anywhere. And they were right. Not that many people make it in this business, this world. A lot of people like to watch it. And this was just so thick-headed I know, it was probably a comedy routine and he thought it would be funny, but his backlash on his channel, it's its harsh. You have a lot of YouTubers again just playing out pissed off about this and I don't see why. I understand he might have thought it was funny, but it did. It was just not funny to people who do watch the videos. For some reason, I got a little bit offended by this and I know that sounds weird and so petty that I got offended by something so simple and stupid on the internet. But it does. It's offensive to somebody who does enjoy this type of entertainment and enjoys watching videos and producing videos and all that type of stuff. And you know that this year had to be pretty big to get me to come out of an almost six month hiatus of making videos. And uh, yeah, that was all I had to say. I'm going to link the video down below so you can go watch it. Leave me your thoughts. Tell me what you think. Do you think he's an idiot? Do you think this is okay? Do you think it was just funny? Uh, are you offended by it? I don't know what to say, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace. Drop the beat!